crypto lightsaber back again with another video and today we're going to talk about the graph we are also going to talk about bubble network which has now been listed on coin gecko people have had questions as to why this was on on coin gecko yet is it a scam because it's not on coin gecko all that sort of stuff i don't know why it took so long to get on coin gecko but it is now on coin gecko all right guys market cap information is not there um, at the moment but we see that a lot with a lot of coins with the question mark until it gets updated all right guys the price is quite stabilized and uh, probably a better time to buy than it was over here it is also on live coin watch which does have a little bit more information coincidentally um, uh, it was listed on the same day currently around 250 market cap all right so um, very low cap and lots of potential for price appreciation all right guys go and check out bubble network i will also leave a link for the coin telegraph article for bubble network in the description okay this was released last week sometime it basically explains what bubble network is why it's called bubble and it also talks about the staking and the farming uh, side of things just very briefly all right farming we have the bubble eve pair get your LP tokens all right and you can actually farm to a 98% in the B valve finance token that's BBV because bubble is is, is deflationary token it has a 30% minimum supply uh, because it started off at 100,000 tokens 5% burn ratio on each transaction that will continue until 70% of the supply is burnt so there will only be 30,000 tokens left which will make it scarce so as each transaction happens it's becoming more scarce there's no mint functionality to create new bubble tokens, which is why a new token had to be created in order to enable farming. So you can earn BBV tokens on the farming interface. And then you can also stake those BBV tokens and earn 1% a day on your BBV. All right, guys, so after 100 days, you would have made 100%. So definitely go and check that out. You can also buy this token on Uniswap as well, BBV. So we have BBL. And then we have the other token BBV. Go and check that out, guys. All right, very low market cap. And um, you know, once we see bull season come into play, uh, well, we've already seen it with Bitcoin, for example. Bitcoin's just on its way to 24, 25k. Um, money's going to flow out of Bitcoin into the old coins. All right, guys. Right now, Bitcoin dominance is uh, quite high. We expect Bitcoin, the Bitcoin price, to go higher. But money will flow out of Bitcoin into the high cap old coins. Then into the mid cap old coins and then into the low cap old coins and the low cap old coins gonna make you a lot of money if you're in the right coins all right so for me obviously bubble network is taking a step in the right direction and we are making some progress at least okay moving on uh, we're going to talk about the graph but xrp that's that's what i wanted to talk about so xrp is actually taking a bit of a hit they are in a little bit of trouble with the SEC, Securities and Exchange Commission. And um, you can go and check that out. It's all over the news at the moment. But um, we see that that is affecting price action. A lot of people will get shaken out. Um, a lot of other people see it as an opportunity to buy, uh, to get it at a discount, especially after it was up over probably another 50% from here, around 64 cents approximately. So there might be an opportunity for you to get some cheap xrp okay we do see some tokens that are still up we've got bitcoin which is still up litecoin we've got Chainlink, which is down all right guys and there is a lot of red there is a lot of red all right on the day we can see xrp is down 33 percent so i wanted to talk about the graph okay the graph is coming in at number 42 at the moment a lot of people are very bullish on the graph understandably it just came out of nowhere all right, guys, we even see that you can actually do quizzes and earn on the graph, okay? And you can also do it on, on, on not only CoinMarketCap, but also on Coinbase, all right? And that launched the day after it launched on Coinbase. It was a Coinbase venture, and, you know, a lot of people aped into the graph. Um, it just came out of nowhere. The only coin that I remember doing something like that as well was the Uni token, all right? That just came out of nowhere. It launched on Coinbase, Binance. Uh, Qcoin, it was everywhere, literally within like 24 hours. Uh, the graph, similar, all right. The graph just launched uh, uh, straight away, and it just turned up on Coinbase. I think it was launched on on Coinbase first, and then Binance and um, Huobi. 
I do expect to see it on a lot more exchanges and hence we will see a lot more uh, trading volume coming through the coin as well. Now it's actually paired with a USD, uh, USDC coin, they've got a USDC pairing, they've got both that pairing and they've got the RAT Ethereum pairing. I think USDC coin will actually rise in the ranks, I, I really do. A lot more people are using it and with big coins like that giving it a lot more attention, you know, whether it will overtake Tether, I mean, that's obviously a big ask um, at this point, you know, Tether being number three. And it, it, it would take a lot for it to, to overtake uh, the, the number three spot for Tether. But it's currently sitting at number 11. So it's just underneath the top 10 at the moment. It could push past Polkadot or Cardano or any of these uh, pretty soon. And that's just my opinion. All right. Now, um, also, uh, uh, we wanted to talk about the chart a little bit. Okay, we are getting a bit of a bounce. Let's just get rid of that. We're getting a bit of a bounce on the chart. Okay, and you can see I've got this double bottom drawn in over here. I mean, it's, it's on the short term, obviously, we're only on the 15 minute chart. But we see that it put in a higher high over here, and it's now put in a higher low before getting that bounce. All right, then it's come over, and that hasn't taken out that level. Okay, so this was the previous uh, support. So I didn't want to see it break down below that level. It hit that level twice, we got a double bottom and it moved to the upside. Now we're looking at this level, okay, that we don't want to fall below. And it is getting that bounce. So we've also got a double bottom bounce over here as well. Okay, let's just get the paintbrush and draw that on. We've got a double bottom bounce over here as well. Okay, so hopefully we can get this to put in another higher high. All right, and then we know that we're definitely going to see some more upside on the graph. So it's looking good. It's looking good, guys. Um, the hype has not died yet, in my opinion. Before we end the video, I want to quickly talk about Y token. They are just underneath 50,000 Ethereum, 90% of which is going to liquidity. I am going to leave a link in the description for you to buy this and get 10% extra on your purchase. All right, guys. I will also receive 10% for that. If you go to my dashboard, you will see I've referred quite a lot of this and um, this is going up every single day we see more and more referrals coming in 184 referrals um 275.86 ETH the reward bonus I'll get 10% of Ethereum raised on that and you will also get 10% for using that now one thing that struck me by surprise is that somebody actually put in a very large amount of Ethereum just yesterday look at that 83 Ethereum using my referral link so that yeah a lot of people are putting a lot of money into wise I think that's about fifty one thousand dollars okay so there's a lot of money going into this if we look at exactly how much is raised okay even up to date forty eight point nine nine six thousand Ethereum if we go to wise info .io, it was fifty eight million the last time I checked now obviously that is with the WISE token and the Ethereum that's going to go in. So we're looking at 59.2 million at the moment. And it's ranked 7th in terms of the amount of liquidity that's going to go in on Uniswap. Okay. So that's going to be in the top 10. Uh, probably, well, it's going to be in the top 7 at the moment. Okay. And that's up there with all the stable coins. All right. So remember, this pre-sale is ending on the 30th of December at midnight. Definitely bullish on WISE. Um, I can't stress to you enough, this is probably the biggest thing to come uh, in December, in my opinion. And that's why I keep pushing it. All right, guys. So I do appreciate everyone's support. All those using my referral link, you obviously trust my instincts. But, you know, do your own research, okay? Never invest more than what you can afford to lose. And just invest responsibly. It might be a safe bet as well to kind of save some Ethereum on the sides uh, just to get um, maybe try and get in when it does list on Uniswap as well. That might be a good idea. All right, guys, so that's about it for now. If you're not subscribed to the channel, make sure you subscribe, like, and comment. I'll see you in the next video.